In this video, we will take a tour of the Google Classroom from a student perspective. Your student will need to log in to the Google Classroom using the Clever portal. Once your student is at the home Google Classroom dashboard, they will need to open their Google Classroom. Your student will be on the screen. They will be able to see the Google Meet link, so when they need to join a Google Meet, they can click this link and directly go to the meeting. Students cannot create a meeting by themselves. They will need to wait for their teacher to start the Google Meet. Students can also see upcoming work. We can see that tomorrow we have informational writing due and Friday math fluency due. If you want to see more details of the work that is upcoming, click View All. My student can also click to see more information by clicking View Details. Now I can see the directions, and when I have completed the work, I can mark it as done. Back on the stream, I can see announcements posted by my teacher. Sometimes these announcements will simply tell you things that you need to be aware of, and sometimes you need to respond. Next, your student will look at the Classwork tab. Students will spend most of their time on the Classwork tab. You can filter by topics on the left, I can view all of my work. I can also join a Google Meet from the Classwork tab. I can view the Google Calendar associated with my Google Classroom. And I can also go to the Classroom Drive. Right here we'll look under the ELA Informational Writing. When I click on it, I see a short snapshot of the work. I need to click View Assignment to see all of the directions and do the work. I can see that this assignment is worth four points and due tomorrow. Next, I will click on the Classwork tab. On the Classwork tab, I can join a Google Meet, access my Google Calendar associated with this Google Classroom, as well as my Class Drive, which holds all of my work. Right here, I can see topics. I have two, an English Language Arts and a Math topic. And underneath each topic is Assignments. As a student, I can click on the assignment, click View Assignment to see more details. Next, you'll have the People tab. In the People tab, you can see your teachers and other students, and you can email your teacher from this tab.